Hey guys, it's Mr. Crayfish and welcome back. Today, I am showing you guys 10 modern furniture ideas that you guys can build in Minecraft. Now, it should be mentioned that these designs today are completely original. I've come up with everything in this, so you're going to have some pretty amazing decorations and furniture to build in your house. Now before I go ahead and show you guys these 10 pieces of modern furniture, make sure you go ahead and snap that like button because YouTube algorithms have changed now and we're going to do some crazy stuff to actually get our, well, to get my videos noticed now so make sure you hit that like button, also subscribe and press that bell notification as well so you don't miss out on any of my videos. But let's go ahead and let's start now. So the first piece of modern furniture we are looking at is a chair. Now, I personally love this one, and this is why I put it right at the start here. So the best thing about this is actually the cushion on the chair. Like, look at that. That is actually an armor stand with a leather cap on top. We've got a cool graphic here by using an item frame behind the banner. We've got trap iron trap doors on the side here, and then just some wooden ones on the back there. And overall, this thing just looks amazing. I really loved how this actually turned out when I was designing it. Now, onto the next piece of furniture. So, this next piece is the fish tank. Now, this looks really sleek and modern. I really like how this actually turned out. So, we got ice at the front here. We're again using quartz to follow this modern theme. Got uh, uh, wooden trapdoors on the side there. And on the inside there, we're actually using Podzel because it has a bit of more of a mossy look. Uh, we've got a, a fish in an item frame and then also just some grass and a button in there to simulate kind of like a coral reef. Now onto the next piece. So this is a kitchen and it's more so a set of furniture and again um, I'm really, I really love how a lot of these turned out. So we're use, we've got some cabinets here, so we're using a clay block there, we've got a banner and an item frame and what we put in the item frame is actually a trap door to simulate that handle there. We've got a little sink here, which we're using a trap door at the front, water, and then a tripwire hook. Now, this is really cool here. This is the fridge. So, if we actually right-click this bottom piece here, it's actually a shulker box. So, you can actually store food in it while also keeping a good uh, fridge design. There is also a little window there just to let some light in. And overall, this is a nice piece to put in your house. Now, on to the next piece. Now this one did push the theme of modern, but it is a grandfather clock and I've just put the modern twist to it. So as you can see, I've used a lot of quartz in this design. Uh, we've got iron trapdoors on the side there. And then of course, we've also got the time at the top there. Uh, so we can see it's midday right now. Now if we actually step on this pressure plate here, you can see that we've got the pendulum inside, but also down below here, we've got an ender chest, so it's not just to see the time, it can also be a place to store your ender chest as well. Personally, not one of my favourites, but I still think it's good. Now, on to the next piece. Here we have the cupboard, and I spent quite a bunch of iterations actually coming up with this final design here. So, one thing I really like about this is it's really open, uh, and these trap doors on the side here, some reason I'm just like, I really like when they're back to back like that, they have like a really cool texture to them. Uh, again, we're using the same technique by having the banners, the item frames, and then the trap doors simulating the handles. Then on the inside, we've just got a flower there, and then also just a bit of a point in the center at the top. We've also got a different color for the back as well. It's a red color, and overall, um, this is definitely a piece you should definitely build. Now, the next piece is the table, and again, that I've said for every single piece so far, it looks amazing. So what we're using here is actually powered pistons. On top of the pistons, you're using white carpet. We've got banners all around the edges here. Now, you see this graphic right here? This is exactly the same as we used on the chair. And this is why this table is good to combo up with that chair that we built at the start. So if you're gonna use it, put those chairs next to it and it will look amazing. So that's the table, let's move on to the next piece. Here we have the umbrella and lazy boy. So this is something that you would build next to your pool. So let's go ahead and let's have a look at the lazy boy here. So we're using quartz for the base and then trap doors for the armrest. Here we're using end rod for the stand of the umbrella. Now you see the string here, this is supporting up the carpet at the top here. Otherwise you wouldn't be able to place it there. We've got a little flower at the back also. And because it's so simple, it looks so aesthetically pleasing. 
So the next piece we have here is the toilet. Now there's not too much I can say about this because it is a very, very simple design. But as you can see on the side here, we got two quartz stairs there for the bottom. Now I actually haven't seen anybody use this, uh, actually use a stair there because it kind of simulates more of the piping. Uh, we've got iron trap doors at the top and the bottom there. However, uh, the button kind of doesn't work. It's more just for aesthetics and as you saw there, um, the trap doors pop up. We've also got some carpet around the edge there just in case you, you know, nah, it's just, it's just for decoration, don't worry. Now on to the next piece. And here we have the bed suite and this is personally one of my favourites out of the whole lot here. Um, for obvious reasons. So we're using red wool as the blanket here. We've got quartz blocks as the pillow. Kind of has that ironed feel to it. Trap doors around the edge here. And then uh, we've also got some bedside cabinets, but I decided to put them into the wall here because uh, you couldn't put them right up to the bed. Uh, that's an alarm clock. And then we just got a little flower over the top. Picture at the top here. And then also his and hers pillows, which rest on the top of the bed. Now obviously you can't sleep in it, but nonetheless this looks awesome and definitely you should build it if you want to have a cool modern home. So this is the last piece and it's sad that we're at the end of this video almost, but this is the fireplace. So I've used quartz here in a cool fashion, so as you can see I've placed them outwards and then inwards for the sides there. Uh, we've got this cool design with the funnel here, it's kind of like a gradient, so at the bottom here we've got a shulker box, we then got granite and then cobblestone at the top here. We're again using that same graphic with the banner and the item frame behind. Behind here also we've got a shulker box so it does have, have a little bit of functionality as well. You can uh, probably use it to store some secret items and then iron bars at the front. Overall this looks really awesome. So that is going to end off this video today guys. Let me know down in the comments right now. Okay go, go down there right now. Go down there right now okay. Type in there which your favourite piece of furniture was, I'd love to know. I'm also going to be doing more of these videos, so make sure you go ahead and subscribe as well. And I will see you guys later. Bye bye!